Welcome back, friends, family, and other strangers that watch my vlog. Coronacation Part 9, where I finally leave New Jersey, adventure into the northern country of Vermont. Wish me luck. Here I am, getting ready to ride the Peloton for the very first time. A little scary, but it's okay. I did a Hamilton ride and it was fun. Then we had a little barbecue and pool day, and Dad got awful tan lines, as you can tell from his neck. That's it. Oh my god. Dear god. Did you get it? Yes. Oh, you were Then I finally got my projector in for my birthday, and it was so sick, I was just staring at my wall for a good three hours. <laughs> Beach day. <laughs> it's hot. <laughs> We are at Asbury, low-key kind of crowded, but we social distancing. About to hop in the water, very hot. We got these pineapple drinks, they are pretty fire. And we got these amazing mushroom and fish tacos with the chips and guac. It was so good. <laughs> then we went to this cute little ice cream place and got all these weird flavors. This place was super awesome because they had more vegan flavors than regular flavors. We got the coolest flavors, matcha, lavender, and turmeric. Mm -hmm. Next day, I made some pancakes and started packing for my trip to Vermont. Mm -hmm. Then we drove up to Haley's, car packed to the gills, no room, hi, hi, Haley. Oh, and hi. was ready. <laughs> like, wait, where's everyone going? <laughs> this is nervous. This was and there we go, it was a really fun six hour, super quick drive, had a lot of fun, saw a lot of farms, a lot of mountains, and then we made it to our cute little resort, Snuggler's Notch. It was super nice, everyone there was very, very kind, and it was just a super cute resort. And then we basically took the shuttle everywhere to our room, to the pond. It's basically our Uber. Then we went out for a little lunch, and of course, I had to try the maple chicken. And then we took the shuttle to the pond. I mean, these mountains were just insane to look at. And we just chilled in the water, had some fun. And this is the view from our porch in our resort. I mean, this is crazy. I've never seen so many mountains in my life. And then, of course, sunset happened, and we had to have a little photo shoot. <laughs> Then the next day we ventured out into the woods, very deep into the woods, for a little hike. And these roads were terrifying, um, some were only one way. <laughs> hike time! Let's just follow that. <laughs> and so the journey to the top began, and it was not easy. <laughs> What'd you find? Today I'm oh. sure, but now it's stuck on my finger. Ew. Eventually we found ourselves to the beautiful waterfalls. These were honestly gorgeous, and yes, I did jump in, and it was freezing. I thought I was going to have a hypothermia and die, but we had some cool photos, and it was worth it, right? Then we went to the pool at the resort, and I'm pretty mad because the slide was closed, and it looked really fun. And we had a little taco night, and of course we had to finally try Vermont's famous Ben and Jerry's. I was very excited. The line was actually super long, um, but it was pretty fire, so I'm happy with it. Then we watched a super dope lightning storm. Like, it was insane, and you could see it all over the mountains. It was super spooky. Then the next day, I went on a little run through the woods, and we went on another hike, yet again back into the forest. And this one was a long one, almost 45 minutes to get there, 
and very, very, very inclined. Not great. <laughs> I got too excited. We're so close. And finally, somehow, some way, we made it to the pond. And of course, as soon as we get there, it starts pouring. We love that. But I did get to touch a lily pad, which was on my bucket list. So, you know, success there. And our journey back was great because it was pouring the whole time, but somehow we made it down. It was literally a monsoon. That was the longest hike I have ever been on my hike. We did it! Woo! Then after the pouring rain, we went to the pool for a little bit of sunshine. Then the next day, all I did was pour, so we binge watched the entire Umbrella Academy and went out to dinner in the pouring rain. Fun. And once again, we went to the pond and that was kind of a fail because of the pouring rain. But then it stopped, so we decided to go on yet another hike. And yes, look at these roads, they're one way, absolutely terrifying. Youngins. Youngins. But yeah, this hike was pretty fun. Not as long as the other one. So we were happy about that. And the waterfall was huge. Also a lot less rocks, which I was happy about, um, but these planks definitely made it interesting. Then we went shopping in Stowe, went to a bunch of cute little stores, and of course I had to get some maple syrup for the fam so they could try the authentic Vermont syrup. Then the next day we got ready to ride. We drove up to this horse ranch thing and it was super cute. All the horses were so funny and had little names, but the best part was that they had all these little doggies. They were everywhere and they were so freaking cute. That's Coco Bean. I love him. My horse's name was Johnny. He was huge. Um, yeah, all the other horses, normal size, but this one, absolutely humongous. Of course, we had to have another little photo shoot. Tonight was white night, so we all wore white and took super cute photos. before heading up to this awesome Mexican place. Um, the food was pretty good and the outside seating was awesome, but it did take an hour and I was starving, but that burrito made it worth it. And then we just hung out and messed around for the rest of the night before having to leave. So sad. But yeah, we had to say bye bye to the awesome resort and we head home. And that five hour drive literally felt like we were in the car for days. Luckily, we stopped at this really good barbecue place, and that was basically my saving grace. But the great adventure did not end there, no sir. Now I was getting ready to go camping with the fam. Never been camping, by the way. First day camping show. Camping dinner! Woo! I like chicken a lot. Chicken's my favorite. But yeah, you know, we out here feasting, had a great barbecue, and then we had some pie. Very good. Then we hung out by the fire, made some s'mores, and of course had some laughs as we slowly watched one by one people falling asleep. Then Marcus told a really inappropriate joke and got the whole family shook. Maddie, come here! Maddie, come here! Maddie, come here! Maddie, come here! Then of course I had to, you know, culture them and teach them secret Hitler. Picking my interest! I'm Eva, you are safe. You are safe. <laughs> yeah, listen to it. The Marcus. <laughs> yeah. no, Marcus. Next morning, we woke up to a nice foggy morning. Had some pancakes. Oh yeah, we actually cooked them. Some delicious pineapple, watermelon, of course, and just chilled out. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> coffee? Coffee. Coffee. You're a coffee talker or anything? 
Thank you. So delicious. So. And then we went off in our rafts for white water rafting. Um, it was absolutely terrifying. We were rowing for about four hours in the blazing sun. Luckily, we packed sandwiches, so that was good. And we did see this pretty waterfall on our way. Um, but yeah, it's definitely an experience that I'll never forget. And then Moose's shoes got really dirty, so we decided to continue the camping tradition and uh, just throw them up in the trees. Everyone signed them, and they uh, were preparing for liftoff. Will someday be worth something? More than $12? That's how much you well, bought them no, at Walmart for, Dad. I wish you better. I have no idea. Not more than $12. Everybody put in five bucks. No. Whoever gets it up there takes the pot. Oh. No, that's it counts. Count. Yeah, it no, counts. it's too low. It's on the trick. It's Eva. Show them how it's done. Ooh, she has a... Leave them just for people. It's okay. But yeah, we had some lunch and just watched those homies in the pool just vibing, straight vibing over there. Then I had my first roasted hot dog and let me say, so much better than barbecue, boil, all that. This was fire, literally. Hot dogs, here we go. Hot dogs grilled on the fire. <laughs> I love camping. <laughs> and here's us vibing with Sleepy Moo. But yeah, after the rafting, everyone was pretty much knocked, so we pretty much just took videos of everyone sleeping. Let's look at the tent if you want to get a video of her. Trip. Let's go. And then it was dinner time, so you know, we preparing the feast. Oh yeah, barbecue action, some different side dishes. Oh yeah. And of course, we had to try out the pudrons. That one I just got was sweet. Look at me crying. There are some good stores. Go. It's delicious. Eat it, dude. Don't eat the whole thing. It's sweet. James, you have to put it in your mouth. I did. Then Eva started teaching us her rip routine as a fitness instructor. So good, so much talent. Then we attempted to cook some cookies, uh, but it was kind of a fail. They all just kind of burned. So of course we had to, you know, roast some s'mores. Perfect. And then, you know, just hung out by the fire and bust each other's chops. I will never simp for a girl. And if I will never simp for a and girl. And if you do, we have permission to go and to your friend group and do. alert them. Then came home from camping, absolutely exhausted. Took a shower and got some froyo with the fam. But yeah, I'm gonna end the vlog there. Uh, camping, Vermont, I mean, just a lot of fun this last couple weeks of August. Um, and now you'll see more cousin action some more friend time, and pretty much the last couple weeks of August. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe. You know the vibe. All right, ciao.